man, we are just grinding through the tears here. So, as you know, the Marvel Legends Haslam Sentinel was revealed during Fan First Friday last week. And one of the big incentives was that there were bonus accessories or additions that were added for every extra thousand backers that we got past the 6,000 needed to actually get this product in production. Um, and tier one, as you probably know, was the Master Mold Head, and that was unlocked at 7,000 backers. Then when we reached 8,000 backers, we achieved the damaged, the battle damaged head and hand, and now... We're not quite at 8,000 backers yet. I think we're like less than 100 away, at, at least at the time of recording this video. But they gave us a little sneak peek of the 8,000 backers prize, and it is a female Sentinel Prime. So this is really interesting. Um, so I, I, I don't know much about the comics when it comes to these characters, but the Bastion figure that we're already getting with this set i assume that that's also a sentinel prime and then now you're getting both a female and a male version so um that's cool um and i was actually kind of theorizing about this in yesterday's video when i was talking about the battle damage head and hand um because i was thinking that maybe for the nine thousand backers bonus since that is like nine thousand backers in like three days like we're reaching one goal every 24 hours so that's crazy so i was thinking maybe we could get an an additional six inch figure except i was thinking more like maybe an x-men figure like morph or um bolivar trask the one that actually created the sentinels um but we are getting a female sentinel um thing so uh yeah this is interesting um Definitely not as cool as some of the other characters that we could have gotten. Um, but, I mean, j just getting an additional 6-inch figure here included basically free on top of the 350 that you're already paying for the Sentinel itself. I mean, that's pretty crazy. Um, and I've said it multiple times, like, yes, $350 is a lot. But considering how much you're getting with this figure, I'm surprised it's less than five hundred dollars and this is honestly a pretty good deal um especially with now this additional six inch figure that is if we reach another hundred um backers within the time limit but i mean there's literally like 40 days left of the thing so of course we're going to reach the nine thousand backers goal so we're getting this female sentinel f century thing i i don't know the exact name but um and this is really interesting because, like I said, it's like we're reaching another goal and reaching an extra thousand backers every 24 hours here. So that is pretty crazy. And th this is the third tier, supposedly the final tier, at least from what they talked about during the Fan First Friday event. Um, so there's still like 40 days left of this event. For There's still 40 days left for you to order this thing if you want to get it. And there are rumors going around that we could be getting a fourth and fifth and possibly even sixth tier for this Sentinel thing. Um, I don't know if we would get that far, um, but I mean, Hasbro clearly didn't expect things to go this well, and they're definitely exceeding their expectations. So, I mean, might as well throw in some extra stuff at the rate we're going, because even if they don't add the more extra tiers, we'll probably get to like at least 12,000 or something backers by the end of this thing. Um, but yeah, th this is super exciting. I don't know if we'll get more tiers, but hopefully we do. And I will make more videos on them as soon as they were re revealed. But what do you guys think about this? Are you excited about a female Sentinel Sentry thing? What Whatever this thing is called. Uh, but I, I just think it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, let me know all your thoughts on this down in the comments below, as well as do you think we will get extra tiers added to the Sentinel HasLab project, and what do you think they will be? So thanks so much for watching, please drop a like if you enjoyed this video, and hit that subscribe button so I can keep you up to date on everything that goes on in the Marvel life.